All right, so we're gonna go over how to install this easy seal with the UV die. And anytime you're selling a leak seal, I would also sell the die so that if it ends up leaking out, we can use the UV flashlight and find the leak. So obviously first take it to the package, you should make sure that your gauges are hooked up. And you want your high side hooked up. And this die is going to be injected into the suction line, which is the bigger line here because this is what's sucking into the compressor. So this will suck the die into the system. So we need to hook up our liquid line and I'm only kind of kind of screw this in because I don't have gloves on right now. So I'm just gonna kind of seat this on here. We need your liquid light side connected and then we're gonna take our tube of die and we're gonna go ahead and just seat it on the suction line. So you're just kind of seating it on there. You're not fully tightening it yet. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my middle line and I'm going to start hooking it to my dial line. And I'm going to get it a little bit tight. And then what we want to do is we want to make sure we get the air out of this hose. So you're going to actually crack the liquid line and open it up and it's going to put refrigerant into this hose. And then you're going to just loosen it a little bit, let a little bit of the air out until you see liquid because we're getting the air out of this line. Then you're going to tighten this all the way and then you're going to tighten this all the way onto this uh, service valve here then you're going to crack open your gauges a little bit to let some liquid in do not keep it completely open you will let straight liquid in through the gauges into your compressor you do not want to feed liquid into your compressor so all you're going to need to do is just crack this line open a little bit you'll see the refrigerant coming through the tube once this is empty and this is clear, you let all the dye and sealant through.